So we're nearing the end now and I want to share with you a very advanced e-commerce ranking tip. Okay. And this is what we've been talking about the entire um, you know the entire webinar. You want to focus on increasing your overall domain authority because if you do that, you will be ranking for your main priority keywords much, much, much easier than you thought it would be. And again, like this isn't, you know, there are people that are thematically relevant and they have lower domain authority yet they're ranking above people that have higher domain authority. But at the same time, if you're both, if you're, you're obviously thematically relevant to the keyword you want to rank for, correct? Okay. Then, if you have high, if you have high thematic relevancy to that keyword and you have a high domain authority, you're gonna rank, outrank a lot of. You can even outrank Amazon, possibly, right? And you can you outrank uh, your highest competitor sites. And you can just like it'll make you much easier to rank for your words because those keywords will bring you traffic, and those traffic will convert to sales. And then you can increase your domain authority by on and off page optimization, and that includes your product pages, that includes your um, descriptions, your titles, your meta tags, everything, and then creative content marketing. You know, create creative content that's going to be very useful for you to use. Link building with high domain authority websites. So one of this is the one I just mentioned is now using YouTube. You know, because YouTube is a free resource, right? So in creating a YouTube channel and linking it back to your e-commerce site is definitely going to benefit you in many ways. And it's going to make you seem very authoritative. It's going to be very good. People like watching YouTube videos. You make them fun. And you know, just something that's going to be very stand out for your e-commerce brand. Social media. So make, getting on all the top social medias, using those to link to your website and your domain, and linking back. And then that's going to, in Google's eyes, that's going to increase your domain authority for sure. It's going to give you a good boost. And there's many more different ways. You know, you can get creative with the way that you are doing it. And there's, for example, you know, go on Unity e-commerce, download the guide, the five free tools that successful e-commerce businesses are using to double their profits and sales. We made that guide because we're using those exact tools to build up our unique selling strategies for our private clients. You know, it really, really helps as well as increasing domain authority. And it also talks about creative content and everything. It's a free guide. Go on there, download it, and find out more about it. And oh, <laughs> I keep mentioning again, but um, domain authority is extremely important for a e-commerce business and thematic relevancy. These two are, in Google's eyes, the most important ranking factors. You know, and the, all, all this little list of the on-page to the social media. This is like things to help with thematic relevancy and domain authority. So Google really, really cares and trusts about domain authority and and with um, their thematic relevancy. So now we're nearing the end and that's everything that we need to do, we need to know as e-commerce founders about how to outrank your e-commerce competitors. You know, this is an easy and simple way. It might seem a bit complicated at first, for those of you that are telling me, messaging me now, that's it's gonna take some time. Laugh out loud. It is. It's gonna it's gonna take some time to learn. But you know the three steps that I narrow it down to: Mozbar, download that, install it on your browser, Open Site Explorer, right? Get that get that done. Use it. Search for your competitors. Find out what their metrics are. Search if you don't understand what the terms are, don't even worry about it right now. Just look at the um, the numbers. It's very basic, right? You can tell how many percentage of the links are internal, how many percentage of the links are external, and then as you go as an e-commerce founder, you want to educate yourself on the specific terms and technical terms. Not too technical, 
but understand the basic things of you know on page off page uh, link building high domain authority low domain authority and then because it's just gonna overall help you with the long-term e-commerce business right and third thing is putting that finding out the keywords using Google Keyword Planner it's a free tool right going on it searching for the terms you want and then rank and then finding out how competitive it is to rank for those terms and then using those strategies to rank for those terms so that concludes our webinar <laughs> good, good, good for everyone for bearing through with it I know it got a bit um, uh, complicated there but we tried to still down to the very basics right the four steps so use those four they'll use those three tools and go over this video it's going to be broken down into a few parts browse it and learn from it if you have any questions you can email me I let me see okay you can shoot your emails for those of you that want to reach out at unity ecommerce at outlook.com just shoot me an email you know let me know what keywords you're gonna rank for we can do this together have a lot of fun with it you know it's not all um, boring as much as it might seem like it is um, and yeah so let me know shoot me an email get back to me on you know you can want to help shoot me an email get see what kind of keywords you want to rank for uh, the mods bar if you have any questions about it open site explorer Google Keyword Planner tool let me know and we can go over it together alright I wish you all success and achieving you know fantastic results with what we shared with you today alright alright thank you everyone Take care. I'll see you all on the next webinar.